Wall Street is eyeing slight gains ahead of the Fed rate announcement. In terms of economic figures, retail sales here in the U.S. came in at the weakest level in 16 years, off 0.3 percent. Meanwhile, CPI fell a seasonally adjusted 0.1 percent last month. This came as gasoline uh, prices contributed to the decline. Now, in the previous session, U.S. indices closed higher, lifted by shares in the materials, retail, and software and services sectors. In terms of economic figures in the previous session, PPI broke even month over month in May in line with estimates from an advance of half a percent in the month prior. As for your advances and decliners, 76 percent of S&P 500 constituents traded higher yesterday. And in company news, H&R Block shares are higher, and this comes as the tax preparer reported adjusted fiscal Q4 earnings and sales above expectations. H&R Block also announced a 9 percent dividend increase. As for overseas markets, Asian markets were mostly lower and we saw the Nikkei trade flat while the Hang Seng gained nearly 0.1% and South Korea's Kospi was off 0.1%. European indices are trading higher today. Here in the U.S., for the S&P 500, the buy stocks remain bullish. Now, trading central analysts prefer long positions above the 2435 level, with targets standing at 2443 and 2447 in extension. As for the Nasdaq, a rebound is expected, and for the Dow Jones Industrial Average, a further advance is forecast.